beginning, you can collect five weapon upgrades if you make sure you don't shoot more than three green rocks without collecting the tokens. bonus tokens to chain them for more points. Make bonus tokens follow you to line them up for even bigger bonuses. Leave the big green bonus rock until you have a multiplier, then boost through it for a big score. Green combo scores can be achieved if you destroy a lot of things that are close together. When you have a shield, if you collect another shield token it explodes like a bomb. Wait until there is a lot around you before collecting it. If you don't have a shield, wait until the extra ship token turns into a shield. A shield is more valuable for helping to keep your multiplier high. For big points, store up bombs. At the end of each phase, you get an extra 100 points per second for each bomb. It saves a lot of time, which means more points, if you boost through bosses to destroy them more quickly. The Coventina boss will protect you if you stay inside its arms. When you reach the two flying saucer bosses, you can use one as a shield to protect you from the other. Big scores are all about the multiplier. The longer you stay alive, the bigger your multiplier gets and the more points you score. To get a really high score, you need to keep your multipliers going for as long as possible before the game gets too fast. You should be aiming for a 7 times multiplier at the end of Planet Lave, 9 times at the end of Coventina, and 10 times at the end of Nemain. Once you have a 10x multiplier, change your playing style take less risks and don't die. The gold melter is more powerful if you wiggle it from side to side. If you have an overdrive on the gold melter, spin it rapidly around your ship. This will be a pretty good shield, particularly against gold asteroids. If you're in trouble, use your boost before using your bombs. Your bombs are limited, but boost will always recharge. <laughs> 